Hi, this video is about the Caribou Mathematics Contest. I'm going to show the solution for the May 2014 Grade 5 6 Contest Question 13, which also came up in the Grade 7 8, 9 10, and 11 12 contests. So the question is Two sides of a triangle have lengths of 6 cm and 5 cm. Perry suggests the following possible values for the perimeter of the triangle I, 11 cm double I 15 centimeters and triple I 24 centimeters. Which of Perry's suggestions could be correct? So let's look at case I, the first case. So to find the third side length of a triangle, we will do the perimeter and subtract that by the two side lengths which we know. So we know the two side lengths are 6 centimeters and 5 centimeters. And the perimeter of the triangle for case I is 11 centimeters. So we will do 11 minus 6 is 5, and 5 minus 5 is 0. So the third side length for case I would be 0 centimeters. Okay, so now let's look at case double I, case 2. Okay, now we will use the same strategy and do the perimeter, which is 15 centimeters for case double I, and subtract that by the two side lengths, which we know, which are 6 centimeters and 5 centimeters. So 15 minus 6 is 9, and 9 minus 5 is 4. So therefore, the third side length for case double I would be 4 centimeters. Okay, and now let's look at case triple I. Okay, and again we will use the same strategy, and we will take the perimeter for case triple I, which is 24 centimeters, and subtract that by the two side lengths. So 24 minus 6 is 18, and 18 minus 5 is 13. So the third side length for case triple I would be 13 centimeters. Okay, so now the question is, when would three line segments form a triangle? Well, the one and only condition that these line segments, that any line segments would follow, is a so-called triangular inequality. Now, this triangular inequality states that by taking the sum of any two side lengths, that sum must be greater than the third side length. So now let's look at case I. Of course, we can use common sense and see that zero wouldn't make a triangle, but we can also use the triangular inequality. Now we will take the two shortest sides and we will take the sum of those two shortest sides and see if that sum is greater than the third side, which is the longest side. So zero plus five is five, but five is not greater than six, the longest side. So therefore, case I would not work. Okay, now let's look at case double I. Now we will use the same triangular inequality and take the two shortest sides, which are 4 and 5, and we will take that sum, which is 9, 4 plus 5 is 9, and 9 is greater than 6, which is the longest side. So therefore, we know that case double I would work. Okay, and now let's look at the third and final case, case triple I. So again, we would use the triangular inequality and take the two shortest sides and take that sum. So 5 plus 6 is 11, but 11 is not greater than 13, the longest side. So therefore, case triple I would not work. So therefore, we can see that case 1 and 3 do not work, so only case 2 works. So therefore, by looking at the board, we can see that the only option that would work is option C, only case double I. If you'd like to know more about this contest, please feel free to visit our website at www.brocky.ca slash caribou.